this video, we show how to deploy the dynamic workload console in few simple steps. Before starting, ensure to have the dynamic workload console zip, and the WebSphere application server Liberty Base Jar, already downloaded on your engine. Deploy WebSphere application server Liberty Base. The WebSphere application server Liberty Base has been successfully deployed. Extract the dynamic workload console data. You successfully extracted the data into the DWC95 directory. Now, launch the command to create the tables, and configure the database. Finally, you can deploy the dynamic workload console. In the command, you define the directory where WebSphere application server Liberty Base has been deployed, the installation directory, and the database. The dynamic workload console has been successfully deployed. And you can start using it immediately.